In this video, we will talk more about design types and the grading of designs. I've opened this design in multiple formats. The design grade is found in the lower right corner of the status bar and also found in design and design properties in the bottom of the dialog box. The design grade is no reflection of whether or not the design is bad or good, but will give you clues as to what you can do with the design. The designs classified as all-in-one files are the formats that contain all the information about a design. The object outlines, the object properties, and stitch data like spacing and pull compensation and color information. These designs can be scaled, edited, and reshaped without affecting the quality of the design and the density of the stitches. These are pure art designs. Machine files are files that embroidery machines understand. Each brand of machine will have formats that can be understood by that brand. These are stitch files and contain limited information about the design. Machine files don't contain information about outlines or stitch properties. Some don't carry color information. These can be either C or D designs. Let's look at the design grades so you can get an understanding about what you can do with the different grades of designs. This is a pure art design. Pure embroidery files are created in Bernina embroidery software. There are two ways to get pure art files. One is to create them in the software, and the other is to purchase a pure art design from OESD or another designer who uses our software and saves as pure art. Remember these files have complete design information in a single file and provide 100% perfect scaling. When rescaled, the software recalculates and redraws all stitches automatically. The design density, the fancy fills, and the stitch order are all maintained. And if you notice the difference in stitch count before and after, you can see that stitches were added to this design. This is why it's important for any designs that you create in the software to always save in pure art. I didn't have this same design as a grade B design, but you'll see this is a grade B. These designs were created by OESD prior to design number 11,397 or were created in GNC format. When these designs are converted, they can be read as grade B designs. They can be rescaled more than grade C or D designs and they do increase in stitch count. You can see the difference in the status bar. Grade C designs are read from machine files, and when you open this type of file, you do have a choice of the way it's opened. Options is now highlighted, and when you select that, you can either convert stitches into object shapes or leave stitches as individual objects. The first will convert it as a grade C. The second choice will convert it as a grade D. When grade C designs are increased in size, the stitch count does increase slightly, but if there is a fancy fill in the design, generally you're going to lose the fancy fills. When these types of designs are open, there is a design warning that appears to remind you not to resize the design more than 10%. When this design is open, the stitches are converted to object shapes. If I hold the Alt key down and select part of the design and open object properties, you can see that the object is recognized as a fill stitch. Grade D designs are also machine files but designs have not been converted to objects, but are left as stitches. Note the stitch count in the status bar. When these are resized, stitch count does not increase, so density is not maintained, but this fancy fill is maintained. Once again, only 10% resizing is recommended. Stitch files or machine files contain only stitch coordinates 
and machine function. When opened in the software, stitch blocks are created wherever color change or trims are detected. That is why you get this fragmented look in the grade C design. With grade D designs, if I open up object properties, notice there's no recognizable fill type. This last design is also a stitch format design. It's a DST format. This file does not contain color information. When this design is open, colors have to be corrected in my threads and reassigned thread colors.